Invasive species and fish pathogens, unfortunately, are all around us. We have quite a few very nasty invasive species in Ireland. We're lucky not to have that many fish pathogens. And our job in Inland Fisheries Ireland is to keep it that way. We have very, very healthy fish stocks in many of our natural water, water courses, and we want to keep it that way. Every day, our field staff are involved in operations that bring them into contact with the water. Some of our waters have invasive species, some don't. We certainly don't want to be spreading invasive species from one watercourse that does to an uninfested water. Typical species would be, we would be dealing with would be those that are well known, such as the zebra mussel. And lots of our waters, lots of our catchments have zebra mussel. Another species that we only became familiar with in 2010 is Corbicula or the Asian clam. This is a very, very nasty invertebrate that can cause very serious biodiversity harm and also can affect salmon and trout productivity in our rivers. We also have a wide range of aquatic plants, small fragments of which can be moved by boats, by engines, by nets, even on the undersoles of boots. Brought from one watercourse to another, they will uh, they will set up new populations that will, will cause serious problems. To address those issues, Inland Fisheries Ireland has brought in very strict protocols for its staff. And as I said, the staff have been excellent and they've bought in fully to this. It certainly does involve time because every bit of apparatus we use, from the boots to the dry suits to the nets, everything we use that comes in contact with water must be cleaned and or disinfected after each operation. It can be very involved so that some of our protection staff may have to visit three, four, even five catchments in one day or in one evening. Moving from one catchment to another, it has been agreed among all of the fishery staff that they will clean or disinfect their boots or anything that has come in contact with the water on each of those operations. As I said, it's an involved process, but without the buy-in of the staff, you know, we would not achieve what we are achieving. And what we are achieving is keeping invasive species down. We are not spreading. We are very conscious that we, the staff of Inland Fisheries Island, we are not spreading invasive species within our country.